Hope you guys are doing fantastic. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to set up triggers for restrictedinventory.com. So what you're gonna do is go to triggers and you're gonna click on new trigger set. So back here, you're gonna click on new. You're gonna to wanna to change this to $2. That's gonna ensure that there's enough cushion for you and I to cover the shipping costs to us and to Amazon. The buy cost is going to be zero. We must enter zero in there. If we don't enter anything, it's not gonna work. You can call these triggers restricted. Save trigger set, boom. Okay, now what we're gonna do is click on restore to defaults. Yes, overwrite my current trigger set. All right, it's gonna take us back a page for some reason in a second, and we're gonna have to click on our restricted trigger set again. So I just made this one here. And uh, so now what you're gonna do is you're gonna go down one by one and uh, first change these bottom ones to five. This is gonna ensure that we get profitable inventory and you make profit. There's lots of items that aren't selling for much. And if you crunch numbers, there's uh, something called the Pareto principle. I think that's how you say it. I might've uh, butchered that, but basically 20% of your inventory is going to yield 80% of your profits. So all we're doing is we're finding the 20% of your inventory that's worth a lot. That's what we're doing by using this method. So change all these to the bottom ones to five. And we're going to change this to yes. We're gonna change this to 30. And we're going to change this to 15. So those are the only changes that we're making. Let's change this to 10. So those are the only changes that we're making. So the first one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, six, six triggers are five. Then it's 10, 15, 30, 50. And you're changing these two to yes. So it's always going to reject these. And yeah, this is going to ensure that the inventory you send to restrictedinventory.com is super profitable and we don't lose money which is what we want. We both want more profit. So uh, for DVDs and for music, uh, this one's pretty easy to set up. The first trigger is gonna be, hopefully you're following along with me, I know I'm going fast, one to 125. And we're actually gonna set this for music as well. So you can open up music. So one to 125,000, same for video games. One to 125,000. I'm going to say it the same way every single time. Create new trigger 125,000 and 150,000. So 125,000 to 150,000. Now I'm not going to click on the other triggers right now because we have all, I've already showed, shown you how to go over, but just pause this video and fill these in for the other two triggers as well. And let's go 150 to 175. Oh, what is going on? It's freaking out. It is freaking out right now. There we go. 150 to 175,000. Create new trigger set. 175 to 200. So 175,000 to 200. And these triggers are going to make sure that we make loads of profit off of CDs, DVDs, uh, brand restricted video games, whatever it is. Uh, so this is going to be 200,000 to 600,000. And this last trigger that we're going to set is going to be so last trigger set we're going to set is going to be 600,000, 600 K to, uh, really 10 million. So one, two, three, one, two, three. Boom. Okay, so these are the trigger sets we're going to do. And from top to bottom, we're going to want this to be at least 35. We're going to want this to be at least 20. We're going to want this to be at least uh, 15. And then we'll lower it to 10 for this. And you keep the bottom two at five. So we're going 35, 20, 15, 10, 5, 5. Do that for all three. And now you are set up to send us popular textbooks, CDs, DVDs, video games, everything 
because you have these awesome triggers. So click on save trigger set. Now, whenever you are scanning items that are restricted to restrictedinventory.com, all you need to do, you can do this in your Scout IQ settings on your phone, is uh, go to triggers in your phone and uh, click on the restricted trigger set and you're good to go. You're only gonna send us stuff that's gonna make you money. We don't want you to send us stuff and then we send you the reports at the end of the month and, and some of your items lost you a couple bucks. It's not good for us, it's not good for you. So let's make money together, appreciate you guys. Let's do this business, peace out.